Hello everyone and welcome to Cozy Grove. My name is Melanie V. Thanks for joining me today. It is now day 132 and it's May 12th of 2022. Okay, well, let's start with our inventory. Is there anything we can put away? Yeah, we have a few spots left in our storage. Let's get these items in. And I'll put this eternal egg away. And that can go in there. So it looks like one of our tools are broken, so we'll have to get that fixed. And let's put this into the closet. Okay. And we'll head over to Mr. Kit and see what he has for sale today. Okay, I think I'll purchase the nut flower and I'll get this iron ore and as usual I'll get the greens. I'll take that one and we'll take that. Okay, let's see what the potted plants are. So, oh, there's a potted poppy we don't have as yet. What else is there? Um, this one is also new, but I need happy bird essence for that. Don't need that one. Don't need that. This one I need. An orange bee bomb. I'll take it. What else do we have in here? Oh, there's this, there's another orange bee bomb. Okay, it's different than the other one, so I'll get that as well. And this one I don't need. Ah, another one. Holy cow. There's a lot of new flowers today. Okay, is there any more? Okay, no. I'll purchase the pear tree. And also get this walnut tree. And look at one more. Another pear tree. Let's get these placed down right here in our tree grove. That one will go right there. This one will go here. And the last tree will go right there. And let's go ahead and harvest some of these right now. And we'll harvest some more. We definitely won't have enough space, I don't think. Okay, what's in the wood pile? Probably wood, <laughs> but we'll check it out. And let's check the other one as well. Okay, well, let's get our backpack filled up. Looks like there's a few trees here left. Let's get out our accordion again. Okay, so we've got everything, I think. Let's get this last wood pile. Okay, and let's head over here and get these trees also. Not nearly as many, but we'll take all of them. And check out this wood pile as well. 
it looks like we forgot our bonbons over here. Let's grab those. <laughs> if we can grab those, that is. Do I have enough space? Okay. Let's go back over to Flamey. I think I'm actually going to just get all this fruit into the fire. Here we go. We'll do the nuts as well. Okay, so now we've got a bunch of stuff toasted up. Three hundred sixty-eight lots of fruit and twenty-four nut flour. That is quite a bit. Okay, let's put some of these items away. Let me get that away. And all these roasted fruit. Nope, maybe not. Looks like our storage is full. Okay, let's try putting the wood in. Oh, we got some of them in. And let's go see what Charlotte is up to. What can we help you with, Charlotte? I've seen the entire arc of my life, Scout. I remember everything, but I'm still lost. I need guidance. I need you to orient me to some meaning, some lesson in this old grove. Please, Scout, I need your help. Oh, wow. Charlotte's actually asking for real help. What does she need? So she needs a brooch and a letter of forgiveness. We got those. There you go. Some jewelry and a letter. I was expecting more rangerly provisions. Wait, I recognize this brooch. It belonged to my scout master. I mean, my mother. We went out to such wonderful adventures together before she got sick. Please tell me about her. For years, I stayed by her side. I told her stories about how she'd get better. We chased miracle cures. Towards the end, as the cancer ate her up, all I could do was change her clothes and give her broth to eat, spoonful after spoonful. People told me I was helping, but it didn't feel like I was helping. It just felt like I was ever so patiently watching along as she turned into a ghost. That's so sad. All right then, let me take a look at that letter. It says, it's not your fault. Not my fault. That's ridiculous. Who wrote this letter? How would they know? I failed the island. I failed my mother. Okay. It's all absolutely my fault, isn't it? And if somehow it's not, if these things are unavoidable despite all training and preparation, well, where do I go from here? I suppose I can go anywhere. Ah, poor Charlotte, but at least she's starting to deal with it now. We got a spirit word from her. But her story is still not over yet. Let's head over to Jeremy Crawfall. What can we help you with today, Jeremy? The spirit smiles. So he needs us to find a package. It's by the folding chair. Ah, the folding chair. So now an imp has it though, so it should be a little bit easier to spot. Let's chop down this brush over here. And let's go see what Francesca is up to. It looks like Francesca is doing okay. We'll chop this other brush down. And over to the mayor we'll go. 
Oh, and Mayor Valentina is just fine. Okay, from that leaf pile, we just got a mushroom and some hardwood. And another leaf pile over here. More mushroom and wood. Let's go ahead and harvest this rock right here. And then we can go check in with Beeros. Hello, Beeros. I have at last met with Dahlia of Cosgrove. Twas a difficult discussion. There is still much ground yet to cover. Yet it gladdens my heart to know I need to cover it alone. What did you talk about? Dahlia spoke plainly of my complicity, my willingness to look away. I shut out doubts about my divinity and so allowed my people to suffer. And yet she was not entirely unsympathetic to my own troubles. Thank you, little shade. Perhaps it was the ancestors who placed Dahlia and I in your path. Or perhaps it was simply your compassion that reunited us. My empire, Dahlia's revolution, both are now but an echo of a memory of a long forgotten history. Yet we are still here and there is much we can still make right together. Oh, that's wonderful. Okay, so we got Emperor's Crown. And we got some story advancement from Beerus. Oh, and he's transcending. This is wonderful. Congratulations, Beerus. And now he is golden. Fantastic. Okay, I guess we can say goodbye to him now. An unfamiliar vessel sits at this island's harbor. Be they pirates come to plunder the royal treasury? Investigate this matter at once, young supplicant. Okay, and let's chop down this brush. And we'll head over to Ursula next. And Ursula is doing fine. Let's go ahead and harvest these flowers and trees over here. I think I might just go ahead and sell the flowers I collect here to Mr. Kit. Can I get any more? No, my backpack is full. So we'll head over to Mr. Kit right now. And get all these flowers sold. Uh, also, should I sell the roasted fruit? Oh, actually, I think I'll turn them into some fruit jam instead. Let's sell those. And we'll sell these and these. All the flowers you go. Here we go. We got 295,000 for that. Okay, let's actually go over to see Allison next. And we'll get some of these fruit, lots of fruits, into fruit jam instead. Let's do all of them. And let's see if I can't make some more fruit tinctures as well. Uh, no, I don't have enough fruit jam. Okay. And another pile of shrubs, or fruit trees, rather. So we'll get these fruit. And I think I'll get these all toasted up, too. But I think I'm going to put this little bird friend down here with these others. There you go, you can join your fine friends. And we'll chop down this brush over here for some more mixed greens. And let's go check in with Arjun. Seems that he's doing okay. Let's check out the folding chairs along the way and see if we see any little imps. Oh, there's one. 
this is him. So we cut the package with Jeremy Gruffle. And we'll go over and see Pius of Grizz. The spirit gestures, they are no longer of this world, but your offerings may still reach them. So he needs us to find three ancient symbols. The first one's by a fallen log, so that one's down on the beach. But let's get this imp placed back together over here. And we'll place that right there. Perfect. And another imp revived. And from that little imp, we got a crimson robe and a flamey costume. <laughs> okay, interesting. Let's go check in with Dahlia. Hello, Dahlia. I have met with Beros. He was different from what I expected. He's sort of going through an identity crisis. I found him empathetic and sincere, though still rather ignorant. But it is something we can work on. I have you to thank, little comrade. You should know that I have already disbanded my animal army. I was a fool to pursue violence for a second time, little one. War begat war, and while the history of civilization may be writ in blood, it is its future depends entirely upon empathy. You who have empathized with so many have done more to improve the world than I ever did. Hold these memories in your heart as we will forever hold you in ours. Aw. Okay. Okay, what did we get? A friendship monument. Okay, and is Dahlia going to be golden today too? Yes, Dahlia is also transcending. Wonderful. Okay. I guess we could say goodbye to her as well. Okay. I see the boat, which now lingers at the water's edge. It must have been your doing. My heart aches to bid farewell to a beloved comrade, but your choices are your own. May your path lead you always towards freedom and the freedom of others. Well, goodbye, Dahlia, and congratulations to you. Okay. And Tram's doing okay today. I'll dig up this leaf pile here. And next we'll head over to Ted. Oh, another leaf pile over here though. Let's see what that has. Some mushroom and wood. Ted seems to be doing okay. And some more flowers we can harvest. I'll get these right now. <laughs> Let's see how much we can hold in our backpack. Oh, okay, we're out of space now. Let's go over to Clyde. Okay, what's Clyde up to today? The spirit bows, they are now beyond material things, but they welcome the gesture. And he wants us to find some money stacks. Okay. I have no idea what he needs the money stacks for. Oh, and I still haven't repaired my tool. But let's go ahead and give Flamey the log. And I'll put some stuff away if I can. Maybe I'll go sell some of these flowers to Mr. Kit. Okay. And we'll sell that one. That can go. All these can get sold. And we'll go back over to Flamey.
Okay. Let's put some of this stuff away. Um, let's put that in our storage. And we'll put that away. That can go. And that in there as well. Okay. And we'll go over to Lee Berry and see what he needs. And he needs us to find a broom. Wow. Look for a frowning broken statue and shake it. What? A frowning broken statue? That's definitely different. But I'll get my new potted plants placed down over here. Let's place this one right here. And we place these other two as well. Okay, so we should get three new flowers. And we'll go ahead and play the accordion again. I don't think I'll collect any of that stuff right now though. But here we have our first ancient symbol. The next one is by a dead tree. Okay. I'll grab that shell. And looks like Octavia is doing okay today. There's a couple more shells we can pick up. We'll take all of these. So I need to keep an eye out for the dead tree that has a leaf pile close by. Oh, there's an MP. Probably has one of the money stacks. Okay, and let's donate the new items to the collection. So we can donate that flower. And, oh, we got a new shell as well. And from the shells, we got some old coins and forged gemstones. And for the flower, I'm going to guess 500 for each one again. Oh, no, one was a thousand. Okay, we'll head up here by the tarp for the next imp. Where is he? Oh, there they are. Get that one. Hey. Oh, he's fast. <laughs> he's getting away. Where did he go? There he is. <laughs> okay, and our second money stack. And we'll give Jeremy Gruffle the package. There you go, Jeremy. The spirit gesticulates as if to say, I will always remember you. Okay. And we got a happy bird essence, and a joyous imp essence, and a hundred old coins. Let's go ahead and fix our tool now. So we need to repair the shovel. But we do we have enough charred fish bones? Oh no. So we might have to do a little bit of fishing later. Okay, let's see where the next ancient symbol is. So that one's by the dead tree. The next money stack is by a large vase on a plinth. So we'll head back up to Beerus's area. Oh, oh, here's a statue. Maybe this is what we have to shake. <laughs> oh, no, we got a bag bug. That is not the right statue. But we got another ancient symbol. Okay, let's see their broom. Look for a frowning broken statue. So this one is not frowning. Okay. 
Oh, there's some more up here. I can't tell which one is frowning. Maybe this one? Doesn't look happy. Nope, that's not the right one either. Maybe this guy? Ah, yes, that one is the frowning one. Okay. Now let's see. The next ancient symbol is by a workbench. Okay, let's head down this way. That might be over by Jeremy Gruffle here. Okay, where is it? Oh, there it is. Now we got all three engine symbols. There's some brush here we can chop down. And we'll get some mixed greens from that. Let's head over to Bureaus. Okay, there's the imp. There we go. Now I want to catch that imp. Okay, I've got the third money stack. Now where's the next one? It's near a chapel window. Okay, let's head down this way. So that should be over here by Pius. So we'll hand him these ancient symbols. The spirit is filled with the happy memories you shared. And what did we get? Got a bunch of coins. And a milk pails decoration. And let's chase down this little imp. Hey, stop it, imp. Get back here. Okay. And we got our fourth money stack. And the last one is by a merry bench. So we'll head back over to Ursula here. Which one of you has it? There he is. We'll get that one. If he will stop. <laughs> there we go. Got the fifth money stack. So we'll take that back up to Clyde. Okay, Clyde, we got all the money stacks you required. There you are. The spirit gesticulates as if to say, I will always remember you. And we got a new recipe and a bunch of coins. So we got 1,500 old coins that time. Let's learn the new recipe. And it's a recipe for fishing gear. Oh, that's pretty cute. I like it. Okay, and who is this brood for? Okay, it was for Leaberry. Let's give him back the broom. There you go, Leaberry. Uh, can we talk to Leaberry? There we go. The spirit cherishes your offering. So, from Leaberry, we got some relics. Two hewn bricks and a piece of tile. Very nice. Okay, well, I think that's all the spirits we can help today, but we got two new spirits transcended. So that's pretty fantastic. But that is it for today's episode. Thank you very much for watching.